Gran. The last day. Have you seen her? Hello! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> on our little adventures found myself some some sheep's wool keep me warm every night time <laughs> such beautiful land such beautiful wool <laughs> I think it's some song Sharon I don't this is De Marie from the wild. I'll try to find shelter. Somewhere to poo for the next two days. But what do you think? Good check. We have the fire, we have the shelter, and we have no idea what we got ourselves into. <laughs> <laughs> There's a storm on the way. Yay. Anyway, wish us luck. Night. Is it raining bad? Two o'clock on Monday, and we're all starting to flag with nothing to eat. So we're trying to build traps and eat. Fly balls. Oh, morning of day two. Wet and windy last night. Storm rolled in at about two o'clock this morning. Did you say? <laughs> Easily the yeah. coldest I have ever been in my entire life. Yeah easily um, to the point where we had to break out the emergency foil blankets just to keep us going yeah we had hot rocks and all sorts in there it was uh, pretty gnarly it's so dry <laughs> oh my god it's down here oh. here you go where is it yeah. hey there's also a big mushroom down here but i don't trust mushrooms i'll have a look at it 38 before we have fire as well. God. Long time coming. The parch, can you hear? We need a drink so badly. Um, yeah, we came over a good plan last night though, so. Yeah. Fill in the area. It yep. might ease up on you go. Some more. Raspberry. Do they look like they've got a bit of white powder on them? Oh, come on. Might. Oh, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? It makes one of them full-time jobs, takes a few hours off the... Yeah. What I might do tonight, rather than uh, head to toe with it, is just wrap around the body. Put hot box on the feet. Shadon, how have you found today? Tiring. Very tiring. Very tiring. You hungry? I'm not too bad, to be honest. I kind thought of I'd needs. be a bit more... Yeah, I mean. um, yeah, I think we need to do water on first thing as well because we're getting quite low on that. Get some of to boil. And go for a bit of a forage, get some traps set. How much water did the canteens catch? Not a lot. <laughs> Not a lot. I checked that one over there, the one that uh, Donna threw. Yep. Put it back out. There's not much Not in there. Frustrating. Chew. We'll try and make some maybe rain catches today. Then. So what are you doing, man? So we're cutting up that woolly pimp scarf that Chris found yesterday. <laughs> and, looks uh, devastated. Yeah. <laughs> For the greater good. I'm a pimp no more. <laughs> Rusty jugglers. Pimps um, of state of mind. We're cutting this up into knuckle pads for our feet. So yeah, we'll log back. We'll tune back in when we've got nice protected feet. Yeah. And Donna has caught us some beetles so we can get some protein in and she's took their heads off them already. We will look forward to roasting them later. Mm -hmm. Twinkle toes over here. Oh yeah. How you feeling? Feeling good. Feeling good. Feeling warm. A bit more human. Gonna get some firewood built up. Nice. Just ready to go. And yourself? I feel like a sheep. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. Didn't I? Look at it. It's 
Magnificent. Give it up to you, man. We've just been getting firewood. We found some more containers for water so we can boil and nice. collect. So nice. we're getting hydrated, we're getting, getting nourishment in us. Mate, that raspberry. <laughs> Please stay. I want you, I need you. Oh, God. Please stay. <laughs> Please. We need this to work. Oh, God. <laughs> Where are you, Donna? We are currently trying to find somewhere to survive. With no water, with no nothing. Oh no. And we're all getting dry now. Donna. We'll get some berries. What are we going to do? Oh no. Wait, as long as we've got each other, we're fine. we'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> got the fire going nice and big. Just getting our first water pulled for the day and then we're going to tuck into some scran. Uh, plan for the day is to get some traps built and then reinforce our shelter here. You can see the little gaps. That's where the wind was coming through last night. Made it pretty unbearable. So we're going to get that done and dusted as quick as we can. What are we up to, Kyle? Uh, we've got some nettle here. I've got a mix of green stem and red stem nettle. And we are going to make some cordage. So I'm just about to start processing nettle. Um, yeah, you just got to grab it really confidently trim it like that and you don't get stung. Nice. As soon as you're like, eh, you're going to get stung. Okay, so you just got to grab it, strip it and move up the stem. Very nice. We'll show you what it's like when it's done. What are we doing, lad? So I've just beaten the nettle fibres. Um, we've got the stems here, been de -beefed. So now we're going to beat the fibres, um, beat the stem, sorry, to loosen up the fibres. So you get your thumb in there and you just split all the way up the stem. Some people say not to do that because it affects the integrity, but we are against the clock, so we're just gonna beat them, soften them up, strip them. Nice. We've got some here already. So what have we got here, Kyle? We have our nettle cordage. Okay. So that is a couple of the, quite a few of the nettles into one nice long bit of cord. That is so long. That is really, really long. That is almost my arm span. Oh, oh, yeah, almost my wingspan. So we're going to leave this by the fire just to dry a little bit yep. before we apply it to one of our snares. Nice. Traps. Yeah. So in here, we've got two traps set. We've got one peg there. And you can see the line of hey, um, metal cordage coming off into a loop just there. And then just behind it, we've got another one here. Peg, and it's a loop there, nice and camouflaged. Just got to add some leaf litter to the pegs, and then it's fully camouflaged. It's bad, mate. Oh, well, to be fair, we can play around, can't we? Yeah, absolutely can. We are eating good tonight, then, my man. I was thinking earlier, like, we definitely need to, like, if we get something small, we definitely need to broth it, because that would be the, you know, that would be the, um, the best way to make it last. And broth it. Absolutely. Okay. You want to do it? Mm, can you believe I've done that? You've done such a good job. I'm so proud of you! Because of these girls. Whoop whoop. So our first rat is in process. It's been split. We're just removing all the extre uh, extremities. And then we can start the skin process. I think it's plus more plastic bottles. Big one. More we get. More water we can use. Means less travel into the water source every day, which is lovely. Mate, this two. Two of them? Yeah. That's a bottle each, lads. Yeah, one's got a cap on it. Hey, hey. <laughs> see before, see before we dive in, mate. Right? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to do the... I'm not surprised. So I found some hazel. Um, looks to be up to, just up the track. There's quite a bit of hazel, so we're going to copy some of it. Um, I'm actually going to use some of this as the shelter foliage, just as a, as a layer, not the full foliage but yeah just gonna get some bits of it so we can throw it on our shelter happy days happy days happy days so our first rat is in process it's been split we're just removing all the extre uh, extremities and then we can start the skinning process so where are we at boys 
got our rats skinned, as you can see. Just building up the fire. I'm yeah. just making some forks, knives, nice. whatever you want to call some it. Skewers. Skewers, that's the one. Mm -hmm. Cool, we're just building up this fire a little bit. Just going to get some flames, let it burn down to ember bed. The rats are wrapped up here, nice and gutted, dressed, ready to eat. So let's just build Excellent. this bad boy up. We will update as food is cooking. Just smoking the, the rats out with some heather. Get rid of the flies. What are these bits down here? Oh, we've got some rat kid, uh, livers, sorry. So they've just been hot stoned by the We have fire. Sharon? Yes. What is the shelter called? This shelter is called Camp de Donishiru. <laughs> we love it. Yep. Right, you're on. So this is dinner tonight. So we've got fire weed with some raspberries. So we're going to cook this up. Apparently it tastes like cucumber or asparagus. And then we're going to put the raspberries over it to make a nice sauce. And then this tastes like apple. So we're going to have it for dessert. Oh God, we got a storm coming. Oh, it's here. <laughs> Under the <air> girl. <laughs> It's the morning, the sun's finally coming up. Donald's having a quick nap. That's what it is. I think I'm more being happy when everyone's was like being nice and then we're like, don't be nice to me anymore, be horrible. <laughs> no, you weren't horrible. <coughs> but yeah, this is true emotions now. Sorry, everybody. Love Sorry. you all. I've I mean, had my moment two days. <laughs> two days or yesterday. Not just one day. Two having your time on the walk. Please have a meltdown. <laughs> <laughs> so I had a wee moment yesterday morning, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I did. Blankets before you. I know. Oh, yeah, mate. Like, no playing you, around. You, if you go on a live, she'll get Griff in you for that. Mm. Won't yeah, you? Yeah, won't you? I wait to eh? go on a live. In, yeah. <laughs> no, what, sir? They wait till you're on Sharon. Uh, He's live. He's live. <laughs> uh, oh, with the boys who had the blankets out, <sighs> morning and night. <laughs> Going in for, I love getting lost. I love getting lost. And then I'm like, oh, wait a man. No, no way. We are getting that. Oh, they've not made it easy because we could have eaten that way. We're not crossing the water. No, but there must be a bit that's not. Oh. What's the foot online? Yes, I've watched the programme. Why did you not expect it? Reading, Aaron. What's the ground like? The footing? Uh, it's all right, actually, it's because there's like seaweed in there. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 it. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> We're in mud now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>